Okay, friends, so this is, to me, it looks like the original chain on here. These dogs are just beautiful. Take a look at these dogs. Factory dogs on this saw. Look at this. I mean, the, the, the engineering is, is stupid silly, but so far ahead of their time. Just so far. Mac was, it's hard to explain. Brian, Gray, are you with me, brother? Bellhopper, Mac lovers, are you with me? So when he stuck it in the log over there, we both looked at one another and we noticed that it, it just wasn't, it needs, it needs a filing. And I'm honored to throw a file across this thing right now, honored. So that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna get it cutting. It looks like the rakers uh, are a bit dancey, so we may have to just look at this. So I'm just gonna bring it back to life. It's a big old round chain. So I, I'm not gonna chew much of the chain off because it's a, it's a vintage machine. I'm just gonna get that top corner working again for us, friends, and get the top plate grabbing wood. It's all I'm gonna do. I'm not gonna start hammering on this thing. You'll notice I got my tip so that I can actually file the power saw without it running away on me. And I'm on the log and I'm nice and comfortable and I'm just working by myself. I don't need nobody to hold it for me. It's just take your time, find your spot. Find your spot when you're filing. You gotta get somewhere to to work on a power saw. Now I can work both sides, it's there. It sounds like a two-man saw to me. Okay, thank you.